Hello everyone and welcome back to the calendar screen. No, that's not the name of the game at all. It's Persona 4 Golden and good afternoon. I'm sure you all know it. Yesterday was respect for the aged day. Did you all take care of your elders? Uh, we rescued Naoto, not necessarily our elder, but my grandmother's over 90, but she still gets out and sweats by playing gate ball. I just know she's gonna live over 100 years. Heck, she's almost there. I wish her the best to reach 100. Oh, Narukami, you're a city boy. You might know that. God, I've lived here for a long time, Mr. Kondo. Can we drop the whole city boy thing and... What do we call someone that is in between 90 and 100? That is a Nana Jiri Janirian. And wow, I'm amazed by that brain of yours, you. Are you close to your grandparents? Uh, kind of. A non junior yeah, is a thing. Yeah, and I learned that from Mr. Hosai. Interesting, huh? Say, why don't we practice gate ball so you can play with your elders? Sure, Mr. Kondo. Definitely still, I think still my favorite teacher. I think Miss, um, Egypt lady. I can't, can't think. Sufi is my second favorite, though. Just Because, you know, I, I too like Egyptian uh, folklore a lot. I guess I can't really call it folklore. I think the word mythology is a bit more fitting in this scenario. Anyways, today on September 20th, I'm going to bang my elbow on the desk. And also, we're going to buy some book. You thought I was going to say books. No, we're going to buy a book. Sensei's of Friends, which we're actually going to finish this episode, actually. So, that'll be nice. Now, today... We are going to be, actually not today, but this week, we are going to be finishing up the Priestess Arcana social link. And you're probably thinking, is it rank 9? I don't need the matching persona to get to rank 10. No. You absolutely always need to have the matching persona. Because you never know, you might just have like 59 out of 60 points and be forced into an ST that you did not need. And we're going to probably, yeah, I'm going to grab all the personas that I'm going to be needing. <laughs> I like how my multitasking skills when it comes to personas seem to be... Rather high. Uh, do we, no, we, we don't need Ukabok because we have a. Uh, oh, quite well. I guess we can't get Andra, but we'll get him later on. Eventually. Hmm. I don't think I can really fuse off, so. Not the end of the world. We'll come back once we've finished uh, Yukiko's social link and get that matching arcana of the moon and. Hello? Sir? I was sorry from my work in spring. But I'm helping with the family business now. Lice, the life here is nice too. Cool. Good, good, good for you, man. I kind of just sidetracked me a bit. Anyways, we're gonna head to the shrine, and I forgot for the fiftieth time that I can just teleport directly to the shrine. God dang it! One day I will memorize that function in the game. Anyways, we're gonna summon the fox again today. Because we have not not the hardest uh, quest to complete, but it, it's a little bit on the tricky side. Because I don't know, it's just it's not really tricky at all. I don't really know what I'm talking about, but we got a person that wants to converse better with people. Okay, cool. Actually, no, this one is slightly difficult. So I guess what I was talking about before makes sense because you basically just need a uh, really good understanding to complete this one, and also some other stats. So keep an eye out for that, but yeah. We're not going to be taking care of that today, since it's not really a timed event, and we can knock it out whenever we want. Instead, we're going to go back to Yasogami High and say hello to my girl, Yukiko. Hello, Yukiko. Today, we're going to be completing your social link, and I'm really, really excited about that, because once... The chefs were talking about a new menu the other day. Taste test it, won't you? Yeah... Sure, why not? No, I'm not. God dang it! Why do they force you to talk about Marie all the time? I'm interested in you, Yukiko. We need to complete your social link so we can max out the Priestess Arcana and make some really good priestesses. Yeah, and hello, Yukiko. Would you like to spend the day together? I sure hope so, because I really need that social link complete today. worry, it's good. Is it good? Really? Thank goodness. <laughs> oh, well, of course it is. 
half the cooking was done by the head chef. He took over again. But he told me I've gotten a lot better. I'm also thinking of continuing my studies for a job license. I don't plan to leave anymore, but I thought I might as well. I'm glad I realized sooner. If I'd struck out on my own, I know I would have regretted it. I wanted to become completely self-sufficient, but I think I was being presumptuous. I have the inn, I have my family, I have the waitresses and chefs. I am who I am now because I was raised by such a kind group. When I think of it that way, my problems aren't just my own. That's why I'm going to stay here by my own will. from that shrine to protect you. Mm. I think of you as an irreplaceable friend. No matter how far apart we are, even if we never meet again, that feeling will never change. You're dear to me. known any boys who I could call close friends. I'm very happy. Let's talk, shall we? And thus concludes another social link with one of our party members. A lot of people say that one isn't too terribly interesting, just Yukiko's character in general, but I don't know. I kind of like it. It's a little bit more realistic, I suppose, than some of the other social links, but I still think it's very, very interesting. And yes, today we are going to read a book that we got from Ko. Where the dump is it? Polyland. There it is! This book is actually going to be pretty helpful coming up soon, so we want to take a gander at it. Polyland, a textbook that teaches the very fundamentals of mathematics and the concepts of numbers. Did Ko really learn math from this book? Hmm... That conversation between Mr. Plus and Miss Minus makes learning math needlessly complicated. And since we finished our book, we get to read more of it! Yeah. And another extremely uneventful day at school comes to an end. Now, today we're going to get started on the Fox Request Social Link by heading up to the roof and saying hello to this 
lady. Huh? What do you want? Just to walk up to me and talk to me all of a sudden? Don't you know that's rude? Um, sorry. Um, sorry for blowing up like that. It's fine. I'm not in a hurry to go anywhere or anything. Um, it's not what you said before. This person is obviously mumbling and flustered. Perhaps it's the person that created the request at the shrine. What do you want? Stop staring at my face! Uh, okay. I don't see how our words are exactly harsh, but because they, the game tells us that they are, we need understanding to see through her cold response, and oh, people would have left by now, yelling something at me. You're weird. You're one to talk, and... What are you standing there for? Say something to me, you got that? Um... No? <laughs> and the girl ran away. So basically, as long as it's not raining, we can do that social link. Actually, not social link event, but Fox request. We can rank that up. And I think I actually do have a moon. So don't I have... Yeah, I should have Gira Makala, right? So we should be able to do a social... Yes, we do. Okay. <laughs> Pleasant surprise. We should be able to do a social link with I and get the most amount of points possible. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see what Abby is up to. Apparently not much, since it looks like she ditched us and... Oh, still, she'll be right back and... Yo. Hey, Daisuke. Weird meeting you in this social link, and our class had a guest speaker in the auditorium today, so... Oh, what does the auditorium have to do with soccer? I don't know. And oh, yeah, you guys are both on the soccer team, huh? Hey, isn't Abby Hara your manager? Uh, she is, and seriously, dang, now I'm jealous. Why exactly? And, uh, I, Abihara. Oh, her. She's never around. <laughs> yeah, I don't think she's shown up more than twice, and... <laughs> probably because she's always on the prowl for guys. Yeah, I heard she's pretty loose. And doesn't she look like she's got a sugar daddy or... T Whoa, dude, that's not true at all. I'm kinda mean to start rumoring like that. Yeah, she's stacking the paper. I wonder how much she gets paid. Um... Nothing, and... Dang, dude, don't hold back or anything. You think it's a cheaper market out here in the boonies? Are they talking about what I'm thinking they're talking about? I don't know, man. This is premium grade high school tale we're talking about. And with a body like that... Uh, seriously, just look at her hip... Okay, you guys need to chill out, like seriously. That's my friend you're talking about! Quit talking about Ebi Hara like that. It's not cool, man. She's not a, uh, you know, I don't really need to spell it out, do I? <laughs> Knock it off, guys! Maybe someone should spread some rumors about you and we'll see how you like it. Yeah, exactly, Daisuke. Yeah, it's not cool, man. And alright, alright, jeez! I'm gonna be late for the meeting. Wait, what? Didn't you say you were... Eh, whatever. <laughs> the whole, like, continuity here sorry. is really weird and... Sorry about that. Sounds like they've got the hots for our manager. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. They were talking like that at practice, too. Don't worry. I'll yell at them later, man. Alright, good. Good, we can't let, you know, people go around, you know, saying rumors. That's pretty mean and... Alright, see you later, Daisuke. Peace out, dude. Thanks for uh, sticking up for Abby and running. He ran vertically up the. Actually, no, he went diagonally up the stairs. That's probably. Di oh, hi. Uh, don't worry about those guys. I. It's not a big deal. Who are they, anyways, you know? Get you. Are you just gonna pretend all that stuff didn't happen? No, I acknowledged it. It's not like. That kind of stuff really bothers me. Well, you look very upset. I accept it. They don't even know me. Why should I care what they think? Yeah, that's actually a good way of thinking about it, and I'm fine. But thanks. Oh, okay. Um, I'm glad you're taking it well. <laughs> she seems, uh, pretty happy that we stood up for her. I mean, naturally, if the exact same scenario happened to me, first off, I'd be a little concerned why they were saying my hips were so... <laughs> uh, anyways, I is really, really just flustered right now, which is being expected, so I, I guess, yeah, we should probably walk her home. Sounds like a good idea. Sounds like a good friend move, if you ask me. Anyways, it's a good moral choice to make, you know, defending one of your friends instead of, you know, egging on some random people. And I know you went shopping today, Nanako. 
I gotta work, man. Specifically at the hospital. And yet again, we have a spend time event. And get our, oh, we got our courage to heroic. Heck yes, that's maxed out. <laughs> yes. Yeah, Sayako, I'm, I'm cleaning. I promise. I'm working hard. Trust me. Alright, so, I know it's kind of a hard thing to understand, but when my stats get maxed out, it's a really big moment for me, because I don't gotta worry about it anymore, and that's just great. Anyways, we're gonna talk to this girl again, and, oh, you, I was, I mean, what, what are you doing here? No one asked you to come! Uh, that is true, no one did, and, uh, well, I'm busy, so, so what's on your mind? Um, do you need help talking to people, by any chance? Uh, where, where'd you hear that? Yeah. Oh, it's not like I'm worried about it. Leave me alone. Okay, she is very defensive as usual, it seems. Why don't we just, you know, ask her out? No, just give her some lessons. Just put it out there. And yes, we have a lot of expression, so we offer to teach the girl. And conversation lessons? I don't need them. Leave me alone. Eh, but if you really want to teach me some then maybe I'll listen to you for a while, just to be nice. Uh, um, okay, well first you gotta stop being annoying and t talk and listen equally. Blech. And yes, we gave some tips to the girl to talk to people and she told me this earlier. Uh, that's not right. Um, It would have been most desirable if you would have imparted this wisdom at a much earlier occasion. Um, okay. Like that? Um, th thank you. I hope you can teach me again. Yeah, okay. Bye. Good luck, Missy. And yes, we still have another day to talk to that girl, but not today. Instead, we have to talk to another girl. I, Ebihara, again. After yesterday's events, maybe we should spend some time with her again today, too, to make sure, you know, she's feeling all right. And since we have our one-eyed elephant from Buddhist mythology, We'll talk to Ai and see how things are going with her. Hopefully she's not dwelling too much on what was said yesterday and we hang down the rooftop again. Cool, and she yanked us all the way up here. Sounds about right. You know. Yeah. Thanks. For last time. Oh, no problem. I mean, I was I'm your friend after all, you know. <laughs> maybe we should egg her on a bit and be like, what are you referring to? You know, not the shoe locker. The stupid guys were talking about me. Oh, uh, yes, I, I, uh, now I recall. I guess she's a little embarrassed to say it out loud, though, that we, uh, defended her <laughs> for some reason, and, um, I'm, I'm in a weird mood. Uh-huh. Every time I think about what happened, I can feel my heart beat faster, and I hardly sleep at night. Really? What should I do? Um, sleeping pills? Ah, I, I think. What should I do? I think I'm in love. Oh, isn't it funny? It's funny, isn't it? Like, why now? Ah, I just keep thinking back on that. You mean literally yesterday? <laughs> All right. Daisuke Kun. Oh. You weren't interested in me. Do you know if he has a girlfriend? Uh, do you think maybe it's I'm his type? Or you think he hates people like me? I don't know. I... I mean... He's kind of having girl troubles at the moment. Uh, um... Yeah, I mean, maybe he'd like you, I. Give it a shot. You're right. <laughs> okay, great. Seems she's a little bit happier. I'm not used to... Things like this. You're the only one I can turn to. Don't you have any other friends? I... Uh, maybe not. And Okay, she shared with us her secret that she has a giant crush on our friend Daisuke from Soccer Club. After she... I, well, I kind of defended you too, Ebihara. <laughs> Whatever. I won't dwell on it too long. She can't control who she likes. And Come on, please. You'll help me, right? Sure, just so I can make better moon personas. <laughs> All he needs to do is ask him what his type is, okay? 
Uh, sure. I'm sure it'll come up in casual conversation eventually. Thank goodness. Um, you don't have to do this today or anything, but please. Sure. Get right on that. And yes. Part with the eye in the silence, I guess she was still a little bit embarrassed about expressing her true feelings. After all. Welcome back. And hey, though, Jima, how's it going? Still not shaved after all. And let's actually check out my courage stat, which I'm so excited about. So now our courage is level 5, and our expression is level 5 as well. Now we can just put all the time in the world to those other three stats and max them out. But diligence is going to take forever, so I do not want to work. I actually want to finish that book we were reading the other night. Polyland. So we will get a increase. And I think it's... I'm pretty sure it's intelligence. No, it's actually diligence and knowledge, huh? And now we're... Alright! <laughs> now we have three stats completely maxed out. Heck yeah. Uh, okay, awesome. Now we do not have to worry about our academics. For the rest of the whole game, we're going to get every future exam perfectly correct. Perfectly correct. Good English, John. Anyway, today we have the day off of school, which means we all have to go. Yeah, I always hate getting Fridays off. I mean, I always like it like when we have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday off here in the States. It's always like, you know, this giant weekend. Uh, it's so nice. But we unfortunately don't get those in college anymore. Anyways, we're going to head on over to the riverbank today and speak with Hasano. Death herself. And see how she's doing. And my, you chan, I'm happy to see you. Hi. How's it going? Still depressed and crap? Yes. No, oh, <laughs> she said yes when I asked that. Um, would you like to spend the day together? I hope so, because I came here for a reason. And I'm happy we could meet again. Same. Why do you keep coming back? I must be boring. Listening to this old back stories. Yeah, kind of. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so, yeah, it, it's interesting, you know, to hear about, you know, your stories. Well, you're just a special boy, aren't you? Hmm, okay, good, she liked that. <laughs> Enough about me. I want to hear something from you. Tell me anything. Oh, uh, well, I have this giant bionicle? No, we should probably... Uh, talk a little bit about school and, you know, all of our friends there. I think she'd be interested in that. <laughs> Is that so? You must be brilliant in your classes. Well, I'm actually, uh, you know, a sage now, so that's pretty cool. And I'm starting to think you'd be wasting your time talking to me. <laughs> no, not at all. I wish I could listen to your stories forever and ever. Um, I wish I could tell you stories forever and ever, but unfortunately that's not how time works. As I'm sure you already know. <laughs> it's so sad. <laughs> So sad what happened to Hasano's husband, man. God. But I do not want to see you anymore. Wh what? Um. But but I want to hang out with you, Hasano. What? What's wrong? I'm sorry. You just remind me too much of him. Oh my God. I'm so sorry. Thank you for everything. Goodbye. Uh, I'm, a, I'm at a loss. Is this the end of the social link? Will we ever find out what happened to Hasano's husband? <laughs> of course we will. It's Persona, but yes. She says she doesn't want to see us anymore. What are we supposed to do about that? Well, I guess we'll have to find out later. In the next episode- No, I'm just kidding, there's obviously more to this video. <laughs> if you couldn't tell by the amount of time remaining. So yes, ha Welcome back. Hasano's social link took a tiny bit of a weird turn there. She says she doesn't want to see us anymore. But obviously we're not going to put up with that. We're going to have to go visit her at a later date, but for the time being. These books aren't going to read themselves now, are we? So today we're going to read Sensei's Friends, which we purchased earlier in the episode. 
Let's see what it's about. Began reading Sensei's Friends. The story is about a weak willed milk dose of a teacher who has a hard time getting students to learn a sitcom like story with a cowardly teacher and his companions, the snooty teacher, shady teacher, and the hot teacher. You're filled with tender feelings. How many books does this series have for crying out loud? Oh my god! Yes! So now, all of our stats, except for one, are completely maxed out. Miss Nakayama, I don't give a crap about what you're talking about. I'll advance the dialogue, but... Okay. So now all we have to do is focus on diligence, and everything, everything will just go swimmingly. This is really, really great. So now we, we, know we can make the selections that we want to, and aren't going to be, you know, just restricted by, you know, our stats. It's a really nice feeling in a playthrough when that happens, basically. Uh, she's t talking about, um, nerd girl, or no, no, math girl. I don't really remember what the lesson is called. And yes, Miss Nakayama, probably one of my least favorite teachers. I never really pay attention to what she's listening to. But in case any of you are curious, Read along and completely ignore what I have to say, because let's be honest. Learning about, um, Japanese mathematics is far more interesting than the garbage coming out of my mouth. Anyways, look at my full, beautiful stats, heroic, sage, enthralling, and saintly. Ooh! Now all we have to do is max out diligence, which may actually take a while. Because we just very recently got that to rank 4, so... Eh, it won't take forever, though. Anyways, now that we have enthralling, we actually need to do a tutoring job, and... Oh, oh, the girl. Your lesson didn't work. I, I just tried starting up a cheerful conversation with a girl in my class, but I got nervous all of a sudden. I said something I wasn't even thinking. Ugh. Move aside, ugly. I'm coming through. D what should I do? She just started crying. Uh, no, I don't think transferring would solve your problem. Uh, just say you're sorry. And yeah, since we have enough courage. We pepped her up, and our instructions, you know, about how you have to, you know, fess up to your mistakes that you make in life. You know? It's kind of a good lesson to learn, actually, to be perfectly honest. And you're right, I'll apologize to her. Hurting others without apologizing is selfish and cowardly. I'll go apologize. Maybe after I do, I can try and have a real conversation with her. Wow. The awkward girl is just making so many, like, just... I'm so happy for her. Her social growth is outstanding. And it looks like, you know, I think we accomplished our goal here and helped her a little bit about speaking, which is great. So now we can return that uh, request in to the Fox when we ever so desire. But not today, because we have to do a social link with a very special someone. But before we take care of that, we need to actually go to the shopping district north. And I keep forgetting that's an option in this game. Play too much in Persona 3, god dang it. Anyways, we're going to return to the bulletin board that we have not actually seen for quite some time and see if we have any part-time jobs that might interest us. Hmm. A tutor. Sounds like something that's right up our alley. And you're going to require the highest amount of understanding to do this. Take this job. It's going to give you one of the best Persona social links in the game, hands down. It may not be the most interesting social link per se, but the personas you get from it are hands down the most broken, unfair, and the most powerful. So I recommend it. Anyways, now that we got that, we can choose to either do our hospital job and do... Um, let me look real quick. Okay, we're rank 6. We're resaving. Let me make sure we weren't rank 5. Uh, now that we have that, we can either do our hospital job or the tutoring job, so we'll have a bit of selection in what are you doing, Resay? want to push it. It's so tempting. I can't. I'm an idol. Um, uh, senpai, you weren't listening, were you? Uh, are you free today? Uh, no, I was uh, It's probably not a good idea to push that. It looks rather important. <laughs> Anyways, today we're going to knock out probably one of the longest Rusei social links in the game. I don't know why this is necessarily so wrong. It's not a bad thing, though. I think it's kind of good. And we headed over to Okina again, and Today, we're buying for you. I'll put together the best outfit for you, <laughs> so be prepared. I've already checked out most of the stores. First, over there. Um, alright, more shopping. And that ad! I 
I see. So kind of mean is the new poster girl. Hmm. Oh, is that a problem? Oh, guess she still cares a little bit. And uh, the store sign has a girl who was at the agency with me. Kind of mean, Mashita. She was my junior. She was cute, so I figured she would sell. Uh, okay. Um, it's good, right? You know, you have a replacement. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. If some other girl takes off, I'm sure the agency will leave me alone. Yeah, that's kind of what you want, right? Right? Uh, maybe I'm not so sure. And, hmm. And man, Kanamine is so cute! Uh, it's crazy that she's... St Bro, is she still in middle school? The f You should probably not be saying that too loud. And I like how she's not as fake, like, reset... Okay, what are the chances he would say that right near her? That's all I'm saying. And Yeah, Kanamine's like, plain and honest. Somewhere between a little sister and the girl next door. Like the kind of girl you want to pre Okay... C cool dude <laughs> like seriously they just had to say that next to Risa god that must be uh hard to handle yeah I'm fake <sighs> that's the role I played okay it was on act uh, everything uh, I, I know Risa you don't gotta say it to me and, hey all that stuff about economy is an act too um, she seems a bit flustered <laughs> let's go home senpai I don't want to be here. Um, alright. Anything to get out of shopping? <laughs> okay, so. Yeah, does Risei hold some resentment for her time in show business? Seems like it. Hmm. Maybe you should try and ask her. Then again, she's most likely probably going to tell us anyways. <laughs> and, um... Senpai, are you happy right now? Do you like being with me? Like this? The way that we are now? You like having such a cute underclassman, right? I'm an ex-idol after all. I mean... It's nothing to do with you being an idol, you say. I just like you because you're a good friend, you know? Nothing really special behind it other than that. Why are you being so nice? It doesn't make sense. Uh... Sorry I'll be meaner from now on. <laughs> I'm sorry, senpai. I was... just irritated. Dragged you all the way to Okina, then just came back without doing anything. Uh, I'm really sorry. Um, no oh, reason to apologize, night. and thank you, Nanako, for saving this moment between me and Rise and semi ruining it. Oh, Nanako chan, you're going home? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm going home! <laughs> Nanako is so uh, energetic for some reason, and. Do you know who Kanami Mishita is? Uh, Kanami Mishimana? Do you mean Kanaman? <laughs> yeah, I know her. Some of my friends like her, but not me. I say she sucks and Risei is the best idol in the physical known universe. Uh, you do, huh? <laughs> Thanks. Oh, well, at least Nanako's got her back and. I'm totally different from how I am on TV. You must be disappointed. Nope! I like you! Aw, Nanako. Thanks. But that means you like the me over here. Huh. The, the me? Like the Nintendo things? Uh, aren't you just Risei chan? I like you, that's all. Aww. Um. I guess she's kind of taken aback by that. <laughs> Thanks, Nanako-chan. I like you, too. Aww. Yay! Social acceptance! Huzzah! <laughs> Uh-oh. The show's about to start. I gotta go home now! Peace out, nerds! <laughs> okay, Nanako. See you at home. You're just Risei-chan, huh? What was I thinking? Asking all that to Nanako-chan. Um, I mean, you know, I just wanted some reassurance, I guess. <sighs> Reset. I quit, so I wouldn't have to think about that stuff. Hmm. I have no regrets about showbiz. I wouldn't want to go back. 
Why would I sacrifice my real self? I just want to become a Risei who's needed by the ones who see the real me. I'm like you, senpai. Well, uh, okay. That's the me I want to be. It's the truth. Well, I'm glad you have your goals out there, and you know, you're really passionate about it, Risei. It's admirable that, you know, you see what you want to be in life, but are you absolutely sure about that? I mean, it seems like you still kind of, maybe a little bit, want to go back to show business. I don't know, that's how I see it, and Risei can periodically buff the party. That one is so broken, it's not even funny, and I got a little bit upset today when I heard those kids talk about Kanami. I'm sure I'll forget about it tomorrow. Yeah. I'm sure you will too, Risei, and... Hmm. Can't always take life so seriously, you know? Didn't know Reset was such a worry war. Hey, that's mean! I'm serious here, and you're making me look stupid. Well, stop making it so easy for me. <laughs> I kid, and... <laughs> I see. Maybe I am kind of stupid. <laughs> Thank you, Senpai. I feel a little better now. Alright, great. Alright, turn that frown sideways, and then you got a moon! Alright, I don't think that's how it goes. When I was working, I met lots of people. About the cost of free time to meet people outside of work. I ain't no free time at all. Um, so when I was alone, I was truly alone. Whatever I was thinking about, I had to keep it to myself. So, right now, I don't want to be alone. Stay with me, just a little longer. Oh, uh, okay, Rise. I'm glad I could help you out with your uh, issues, but I gotta go see Phoenix Feather Ranger. R. <laughs> and it looks like she kept us out pretty late, and we missed our favorite show. And no, I'm not gonna do the tutor today. I might do it tomorrow. Depends how I'm feeling. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching this extra long episode of Let's Play Persona 4 Golden. We did so many social links today. It was awesome. We maxed out Yukiko, we helped out I, and we even helped out Rise. And even maxed out all of our staff. Okay, not all of our staffs, but we're getting there. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. See you in the next part where we continue on and hopefully get to October. Bye.